Hello, I'm Gaida Ali and I'm an MP5. Hello, I'm Adam from O and I'm in Group 7 GB. And we're going to show you around to our school today. Do you guys like this field? Yeah. We love it. <laughs> What's your favorite thing about it? Because it's huge, so we can run and have yeah. fun. Um, I like it because we all can play athletics and all kinds of stuff and run around and play tag or something else. Yeah, the facilities we have right now are definitely the best you can get for a school like we have. And um, it's great to work here. It's, it's just delicious. <laughs> Well, the ISC is a big campus and it's mm, quite bigger than other schools. Like, I just enjoy everything in the school. Especially I like the, um, the playgrounds because we can, all of us, in, live in different languages, talk and play together. It wasn't very long ago since the school had been opened. How do you look back on that? No, in fact, this is only our first whole school year that we've been in this campus. Um, it was a lovely period. Could you give some highlights? Yes, there's been lots of highlights, uh, especially because all of them surrounding things like the move here. Uh, having the open day was amazing and having all our students out there singing together and cutting the ribbon, of course, that's one of the highlights. And over the last period, we've had lots of people coming to visit uh, our campus as well. Some people that come to mind are Stats Secretaries, uh, Mr. Sander Deckers, came and had a quick look around, and Vin van Donk, of course, we mentioned. We even had some PSP uh, players coming and having a look around. So it's been a really nice experience seeing all, all people interested in our school. It's a nice school, isn't it? It's, it's nice that you can meet loads of people from loads of different countries, which you probably wouldn't normally meet if you were just at a regular school. And there's a different culture everywhere, and everybody acts differently. <laughs> so, I mean, it's always like interesting seeing how other people behave and stuff like that. What have you learnt from the different students here? Um, lots about different foods, different beliefs, different manners, um, different ways of showing respect. All the different cultures make yeah, even more difference than when you're working with only one culture. Also in sports, so I've learned a lot of new sports myself, basketball and rugby and American football. Just because of all the students here, they bring in their own sports and their own cultures. Why did we choose to bond the primary and secondary together? If you ask from, say, a parent's point of view, they might think it makes much more sense to have to have both their children or two or three of their children all on the same premises so they don't have to drive from one side of the, the town to the other. Um, as a school, if you ask me as a teacher, it's really nice to be able to have all our teachers from the primary right through from our four-year-olds all the way through to the 18-year-olds so that we can develop a really nice program so that the children moving through our school will be able to have a similar um, approach and a si similar way of um, learning. And also it's really nice to have lots of people all with the international background all here on one area. In Spain we had a lot of uh, homework and it was really difficult but here we even have special classes for the people that doesn't speak really well English. These are children who love learning. They come to school every day, they are happy to come to school, they enjoy their time with us and they take every opportunity as an exciting new adventure. What's the atmosphere like in this class? It's always quite full and busy, there's a lot of a volume but that's just because they're working hard and they're really just putting everything into it. The teacher-student relationships here are amazing. Most of them, most of them. There are a couple exceptions but it's like I, I don't have to feel uncomfortable about asking a teacher a question. It's, it's a, a much more personal, easier, more relaxed relationship between the teachers and the students. Uh, students don't really ask like why do we have to study French because they know it is very useful. I did French for like three years and I learned like nothing and then I came here for like a year and I learned more French than I learned throughout those entire three years. 
the curriculum is uh, very international as well. So you um, and and that's what I like that it's 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 very up to date as well, very recent. So you have quite some freedom within the framework of the the MYP and the DP. For example, we did uh, with this group, um, we did uh, a big unit, and that was based on on children's rights. And uh, at the moment, we're talking about the uh, environment, and, and that is something that I really enjoy. Where do you see the future of the ISC? Well, obviously, we want to keep growing and developing. Um, I think if I look, one of the reasons that we came here as a campus, and uh, I talked already about the open day and about all the, the people that helped us get to this place, one of the main things that uh, we stand for is to help support our region. So, in what way is the ISC campus important to the region? Let's ask the mayor. Hello, Adam. How are you doing today? In what way is the IC campus important to the region? Well, it's very important for the region. We really need the people from abroad. We got huge companies here like Philips, ASML, NXP, FEI, and they need people from all over the world. Um, so um, this is a really international community we are we are having here. Twenty-five percent of the people who is living in uh, in Eindhoven is not born in the Netherlands, so, um, well, quite a lot of people are coming from abroad and they take kids with them, mm -hmm. of course, and they will raise them in a proper way, and then they need a proper education, and that's the yeah. international school. How do you experience uh, the school as a parent? It's great. I mean, we have a great community, I think. We are all here. We're outside our comfort zone. We're outside our country. We're away from our families, and so we create a network of our own, and so it's a very close, tight community and we help each other and we just are always meeting new people, it's great. Would you recommend a school like this to someone else? Absolutely, absolutely. We've had only a good experience and we would definitely recommend it. Yeah.